how did you come to know Gary and be part of the Southwind family? Well, I met Gary uh, this when we had the 150 Kansas Art Show uh, a few months ago. That's when I had a few of my paintings accepted in that show. And uh, we became friends and uh, kept in touch. And he said he was going to have a show of uh, some artists that uh, had not been in the area long. And he uh, wondered if I would like to be a part of that. So uh, I jumped at the chance. Many years ago, probably five years ago, I thought I was all I was all that. I, I was painting portraits that looked like the actual people, and I was I was kind of learning to. Well, I, I would say I still have a master color, but I thought at that time I was getting pretty decent with bright colors and composition, and so I would stop in and visit with Gary, and he would school me, and I stopped in many times, and he kind of said, keep going, keep working at it, and um, I did, and then, um, so I've always, and he's been gracious, had me in shows before. Met him when I went to China with Juan, and he and his wife met us over there, and uh, just began a relationship. Well, I was part of the Kansas 150 show, and I've been involved in several of his paint outs. And I've known Gary for years. I've been in a few shows here, and I think the first one might have been uh, the, the KU painting. I don't remember exactly, but, but I was in that one. Well, a friend of mine whose name is Don Lambert is an art advocate in this area and was the person who uh, found Grandma Layton and promoted her work. And I got to know him, and he brought me down here and introduced me to Gary a few years ago. So that's how I got to know Gary to start with. Um, when he started out, he, he did a plein air event at Javara Lake. Uh, then he did a KU plein air paint out. He did the Country Club plein air paint out. I've had a, a two-person show here uh, with Judith Mackey. Um, I keep saying her name, but that's... She's uh, one of my best paint um, So there's been a, a long, long history with Gary uh, Gallery and I. Gary did a, did a competition for the sesquicentennial celebration where he published a book, and I entered a painting. That's how I kicked off my second painting career, was entering into that competition. I got published in the book, and the painting sold right away, and then it just went on from there. I've had, a, I've had shows every month, and they've been selling pretty good.